Hey guys, what's up? It's just me today. Um, Tony's not feeling that well. Today I went back to Taco Bell and we got the uh, Steak White Hot Ranch Fries Burrito. I've had this before and I didn't know it was really a new thing and it was super hot, but we're gonna try it again. That was really good. I never had the steak fries before. Oh, look at that. It's loaded with the white hot ranch. Ooh, it's spicy. Good steak. It's super creamy. Nice melted cheese. The fries. I never thought Taco Bell would have good fries, but man, that's pretty good. Now this wasn't this much, that much really. It was only it was three forty nine for one. Actually, that's a little pricey for a burrito, but it's real good. The flavor is right where you need it to be. The burrito is nice and soft. They put enough of the sauce so it's not super dry. The fries have tons of flavor. The cheese, all obviously, is just cheese. But it's good. It's spicy. It has really, really good flavor. You don't get... Mm. You get a little bit of the ranch, but not much. Mmm. And tomato. A tomato is kind of like a saving grace. It adds a little bit of a little different texture and flavor. It's super good. Oh, but it is a little spicy, guys. I'm not going to lie. I like spice and it's spicy. I know I'm adding mild sauce, but... This is definitely something I think you guys should check out. I think one would be good for most people. It's jam-packed all the way through. There's not like empty space like some burritos. Mm. And even towards the end, there's still sauce and stuff and steak and fries and all that. It's really good. I, I'm pleasantly surprised, guys. Man, this is good. I could eat a few of those and be okay. That's, uh... Man, that's good. Now, even for non-ranch people, I still think you could have it. It's, it's spicy, guys. Hold on. I need a minute. Whew. I wish you guys could like smell the spice. It's spicy, look. That's a decent sized burrito, guys. See? No, oh, look at that. All the cheese, steak and fries. It all kind of works well together. The tomato kind of cools it down. The ranch kind of heats it up. The fries add a good texture. The steak's really good. I'm, this time I'm going to do it without sauce. <clears throat> Just to get the raw <coughs> thing for it. Well. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at that jam-packed this is good you guys got to go try this it's 349 at your local uh taco bell they also have a box that can go with it it's good the total ingredients again are tomato there's not a lot of tomato the white hot ranch sauce liquid cheese shredded cheese steak 
Um, if I didn't say fries, the fries. That's pretty much it. It's good. The steak's pretty, pretty well cooked. The fr I, I, I know I keep on saying this, guys. But those fries, they everything in here makes this what it is. I think it's getting messy, see? It's really good. I recommend it highly. I would get this every, every time I come here. This is that good. And I normally just get regular tacos. Mm. Oh, and sour cream. Oh, that's not sour cream. Ho, ho. Ho. That's not ranch sauce. Oh, my goodness. Whew. Oh. All right, guys. Don't forget. Taco Bell. This was just a quick one to show you the new, what they have new at Taco Bell. That steak white hot fry burrito, ranch burrito. Delicious. I know people, if you don't like spice, please do not do this. This is... Oops. This is not for you. You will not... It, it, it'll be too much. If you enjoy spice, definitely get this. Or if you do get it and you just want to try it, you don't like spice, definitely get a drink. All right, guys. This is HodgePodge. Have a good one.